let's play with challenging our core stability in a different way for this exercise. So the goal of this will be to hold a plank stable and still for an allotted period of time that will be listed in your app. As you hold the plank, that's when you're going to move your hands around in different directions. So you can use body weight only and just reach or tap your hands, or you can use a prop, a light weight, like a water bottle or a light dumbbell, okay? We're gonna come up to a plank, but before we do, know that there's not really a wrong way to do this with the arm movement. The only wrong thing would be losing that plank form. So I like to keep it simple and just think of four points around my body when I come up to the plank. So the four points will be forward of one hand, forward of the other hand, and then to the side of our body, outside of our waist, and then to the other side of our body, okay? You can, because you've got access to, you know, 360 degrees around you more or less, you can play with different directions, different angles, but to keep it simple, maybe start with the four and then you can start to get more and more creative with where you are tapping or placing the prop. So let's come up to our plank. Walk your feet wider than your hips to start. And then when you're ready to make this harder, your feet can be closer together. Straighten your legs, squeeze your glutes, engage your core. Press your hands firmly into the floor and tuck your chin lightly so your chin is not dropping down. From here, now we're going to move to any of those points. So if you don't have a prop, you're reaching or tapping to any of the four points that I talked about. It doesn't have to be the ones on this side either. It can be across, across, right? If you are using a prop, pick up the prop with one hand place it at one of those four points and now switch hands. And now you get to play with where do I move this prop to? Maybe it's out to the opposite side. Now I have to switch without letting my hips rock. And oh shoot, how am I gonna get this? I have to reach ooh, and pick it up, right? So the, the point and the creative part of this is there's no pattern. You're playing with where do I place that prop next or where do I reach to next? And it can just be a fun thing, holding this plank as sturdy and stable as possible. Now you can also perform this from your knees if you would like to, or if you need to. And you can also do this in a tabletop position. Tuck your toes, lift your knees up, let them hover off the floor, and now the same exact thing. We alternate arms, picking up that prop and continuing to move it through those four points. And again, once you've got that down, you can play if you'd like to with like a diagonal or down by your side. It's totally, oh shoot, totally up to you. But again, just have fun with it, play with it, focus on maintaining that really strong form in the plank or the tabletop position.